guys out here for another day on the st. Lawrence River love this place fantastic place to fish could be a trip of a lifetime and uh, you know got on pretty good yesterday got a good bite we're kind of should be spawn time kind of into spawn for some fish maybe some fish moving up pre-spawn got some in about 30 feet of water got some in about five to seven feet of water so still trying to find some on beds Hopefully be able to, but uh, about to throw on a Strike King KVD jerk bait number 200. See if you can't get them that away, but uh, really just Carolina rigging drop shot. That's uh, that's been the tail of the tape. Got one on spy bait. Well, I didn't, but my mom did. So, guys, I appreciate you clicking on this video. Hey, give me a thumbs up if you like this content subscribe to the channel and uh you know maybe head over uh, on instagram check me out at beyond the bounds outdoors give me a subscribe there i post up a lot on instagram and everything but looking forward to it gonna rig the old pro ti up here with the kvd jerk bait let's get after it I would say that's the first one of the day, but it's really not. First one in the boat. First one in the boat. Hooked the good one on the uh, KVD jerk bait, but I throw the old rage crawl out there at him. Right here making the drift. 30 feet of water seems to be the good producer. for <laughs> guys that is uh that's practice for you right there i mean we've probably wasted what not even wasted let him go but we probably spent the last two hours maybe even three i don't know not catching fish and uh you know trying to find the spawning bite doesn't seem to doesn't seem to be working but my 30 feet I mean, right on a drift, I literally sat down and within, but it was first cast, first drop. It didn't take long at all. So, you know, I dialed in my, my Navionics card and everything, my Lake Master card on Humminbird to give me an idea of when, where 30 feet was at for the most of the things. And like I said, ran up here, dropped down, didn't take long, <laughs> which is what you want.
through. And that hook always just pops right out too. Oh shit, he was a good one too. You tried to, you tried to bring him up, didn't you? Yeah. Not until they're ready to come in the net. Boom. Oh, that is a good one. This thing is heavy. Shit. Yours was just as big. Uh huh. Maybe even a shade bigger, it looked yeah. like. Our KVD 200 right there, man. As soon as it hit. Oh. That's a tank. That's what we're here for. Just so happened my mom was hooked up at the same time. That combo. Going with something that looks a little natural to them. They followed a spinner bait up a while ago. Well, not this one, but another one did. So that's what I got here. We're in seven feet of water, probably. KVD 200. KVD swimming china. The KVD knows a thing about. It. Actually, throw back in that area. I don't see if there's another. In the net. <coughs> Bam. So I just pick up the old swim bait. I gotta take a picture of this one. Bam. KVD swimming shiner. Ledge head lures. <laughs> Ledge head lures. Old Bass Geek told me about that one. There he is. Spit it! He was just tiny tight, but uh, another one on the old ledge head lures KV, paired with KVD swimming shiner. Yeah.
Stop. Stop, bro. Stop. No. No. You're going to make me lose my bait. See that jump? A bit bigger of a size. <clears throat> He's heavy, man. For a little guy. He didn't hit it till I hung it up on a rock and then kind of pulled it off of that rock. See, look, I lost my uh, thing. Using a Z-Man right there. I ran the whole hook through it. It's a Mustad grip pin. Can we get him on a jump? It feels like a good one, actually. Because <laughs> he ain't seen the boat yet. When he does, though... You gonna net me one? I'm gonna try. Alright. You ready, you ready co-angler? Alright. Alright, here we go. I'm gonna bring him up and bring him to you. Oh. Oh, he's way down there deep. My bad. Come here again. Oh, you missed him. <gasps> yeah, Ned. Oh my God, he's going to the. He's going to the way in. Look at him, big donkey. Oh my God. You gotta add the uh, YouTube effects in there. Oh my God, he's huge. He's huge. Oh God. Wow. Jeez. What are you doing down there? What are you doing down there? Huh? Oh, look at this megalodon of a brownie. <laughs> Yawn. Boring. Say, uh-uh, man. Captain Fish is fun. <laughs> That's right, you gotta learn to work him. <laughs> oh god, he's tiny. <laughs> oh, he's a tank. He's a tank, Hillary. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> Don't you invoke the name of Billy Lawson on this here boat. More than one East Texas boy you can fish. <laughs> By golly, catching all these here fish. Ah, oh, son of a bitch. Honey is back there just smoking him. Man, he felt like he had some weight to him. We doubled up. Man, we're on, the, we're on the juice. Actually, this guy's coming up. There, there were a couple that were positioned on this hump that's right there that I saw that had good arches, that came back with good arches, so. You mean netchers? Yeah. That's the system. Oh, I got hooked up in your, your old crankbait down there. So I can't. <laughs> Just get in the boat. Yeah. Oh, no, I got it. 
Yeah. Oh, there's another one right there. <laughs> you got it. <sighs> oh. Worms or something. Worms? Look at it. Oh, has he got leeches maybe? Uh, lesions. Gotcha. Yeah. I think they like that color. I think they like that color a lot. You go next. You go next. You just swim into the net. No, we swam under it. Swim into the net, would you? Just swim into the net. It's not that hard. You got a weight to him. <clears throat> Current fish. Oh my goodness. <laughs> How far out that dude was. Hey, my bigger fish have all come off of Carolina rig. It's good size too. <laughs> Wait, I'm gonna I'm gonna bring them forward and then get get ready, ready. Bringing them back. Oh, okay. Let's try that again. Forward. Boom. Got him. Got him. Oh, he is heavy. <laughs> I'd like to know how heavy he is. Uh-huh. Started that drift. <clears throat> Brownie scouts. Look at that. Ah. All right, guys. So that uh, concludes today's practice and uh pretty pretty good day overall found at least one good spot we'll have to check it out see what goes on uh later on in the week see if uh if we're really close to the side but we got a long run to make so let's get to it as always please like comment share subscribe y'all have a good one